everybody welcome back to my channel it's your girl lb if you don't know me and i look good period look at the material as you can see i just showed you all my tutorial on how i quickly installed this with literally um no real effort um i'm a very lazy wig wearer nowadays i really don't be caring to really judge up my wigs like i used to back in the day i haven't even worn a wig in like months at this point but i wanted to put this on because i've been meaning to do a review but considering the hiatus i took off youtube it just never got done but i'm like you know better late than never and i still see a lot of people wearing this hair so i'm like uh, i can put my two cents in this hair is from icy hair this is their mongolian kinky curly and i think i originally got it in a 14 inch this is a pre-made 4x4 lace closure wig so it's not a whole frontal i expose myself you know with my my raggedy hairline not done i haven't done nothing to it because the wig is covering up because that's the point but um y'all know i'm not really a frontal wearer um it's just not my thing i prefer closures i honestly would have preferred a, a larger size closure for this wig particularly um but with the lace shortage and everything it just wasn't going to happen um they only had four by fours and frontals and i'm like i'm not doing a frontal so four by four it is and actually it looked really really good i it looks really, really good, y'all. It looks good. It still looks good. Let me tell y'all when I got this hair. So, I originally bought this hair back in February, I believe. February into January. I bought it for a trip to Mexico that I was going on. Because y'all know, I love Mexico. I've been a bunch of times. But I was like, I really want something short and cute, you know. I originally I originally thought about putting highlights in this wig. But I decided not to um, last minute. And I was just like, no, I'm just cut some layers in it. And as you can see, like here, it's like a layer. I don't want to frizz it up too much. So like, um, like here's a layer. Like it's layers all up and through. Honestly, I could cut this because yeah, I really love this hair, y'all. Like I rarely put it on just because, like I said, I haven't worn wigs in a while. But every time I do and I just spray and put some mousse in it, it just be giving every time, like every time. So yeah, it's still dry, so it does get bigger than this. I'm fluffing it. Um, this side is mostly dry. Let me get closer. As you can see, the curls look good. Um, I could define them more if I decided I want to use some gel. But I really like the fluffy look, so I think I'll probably just leave it as is and just let it dry. But yeah, let me, let me tell y'all. This hair is great like i love it so much um i'm not gonna say it's the best curly hair i've ever had um but it's definitely up there i see hair has some really good curly hair specifically i think even above all the other like china companies that sell hair aliexpress is always the um the go-to for everybody that they want like some really curly um, hair um, a lot of other brands don't even have like super curly hair the shedding on this hair is it's it's more than if you were to get a straight or body wave it's not as bad as it could be in retrospect especially since I've had this since this wig since February February and I literally take it off and throw it somewhere and then go grab it again whenever I'm feeling like you know looking like natural um i'll just throw it go grab it and you know i have to do stuff in it it's not like a grab and go type of wig i'm not gonna lie it's like straight or body wave it's not like a grab and go type of wig but if you put like a little bit of effort into it you you can finesse it like if you're a lazy wig wearer maybe this like me but you know lazy lazy like very beginner beginner lazy um i probably wouldn't get this wig per se maybe try the curly and then work your way up to the kinky curly but um, either way, like, it looks so natural, like, period. It looks so good. So, I've had this hair since February, so that's February, March, April, May, and it's now June, so five months. I can count on both my hands how many times I've, I've worn it, and every time it's a hit, period. But, yeah, I will highly recommend this hair, y'all. It is great. It's amazing. Um, I recommend this to so many people, but I do have to give my warnings for people who don't like high-maintenance hair. So if you don't like to deal with your natural hair, you're not going to like to deal with this. 
But yeah, that's it for this video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love this hair. It is super, super nice. Um, and it's inexpensive, too. It's, it's, a, it's not a cute little coin. It's like, you know, minimal. So if you want something cheap and cute and simple and natural looking, this is the, this is the girl for you. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video once again. Don't forget to leave any comments in the comment section below. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any new videos I post. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.